Okay. What's up guys? It's Katie, Brendan, and Ryan, and I'm just gonna give you like a quick disclaimer right now about my voice. Um, <laughs> I understand that I sound like I'm a guy, but I promise you, I'm just really sick. She's very sick. That's why. I just... I'm fine now. I just I'm, I have some coughs still left, and I'm, I'm not contagious. <laughs> That's what you said. It's been like four days. Mhm. Mm and you still sound like that. So. You should have seen. You should have heard my voice. Chances. Yeah, I literally was talking like four days ago, and I was like. <laughs> yeah, it was horrible. It was kind of pathetic. It was really funny, but so today we're here not to talk about Katie's voice, which uh, she's trying to make it all about. But no, but stop! I'm no, just kidding. I was literally just telling them that I sound like okay, okay. Yeah, funny. <laughs> it so was we're not. taking away Q and A, back to school Q and A. We've been in school for a month. A month now. We've been in school for over a month. So <laughs> let's kick it off with back to school Q and A. Ryan, get us started. Frustration. All right, let's do it. How do you get get to school and how do you get home? Um, simple. Uh, something called the bus. Magic the bus. The magic school bus. Yep. I basically take the magic school bus, but it's big and white and it's called the Ford Flex. And I went oh. to school. People say it looks like an iPhone charger, it looks like a building 747, tissue, tissue box. I've heard it all. Tissue box. Mom yeah. car. Mom car. I mean, I can't complain. It's been getting me. He kind of likes it. Don't you kind of like it? No. I thought someone said you liked it. No. Maybe you just pretend like you like it in front of your friends. Yeah, I'm like, ah, I love Scar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, um, and I Brennan drives me. Back. Yeah. He drives, I go with Brennan. And, and then on the back. way home from school, I have cheer every day after school. So I just, or on Fridays, we either take the bus to away games or we say, at the school for home games, but then every other day. The best thing is, we're the last stop to be picked up. So I just I don't think we're talking about you. Well, I just finished. I don't think it was finished. You're not gonna do anything about it. So after school, stop, after so cheer, I have to get, up I get driven like home by Krista or Dana or one of my everything. friends or my mom gets me. You guys no get that? No one heard what either of you said. You got, so you got from that? now on, you guys are cut off from talking, and I no, will just carry on. No, you can just replay that part. Shh, shh, shh. Stop talking. Replay that part and then watch mine and then watch mine. Do you have a locker? If not, what do you do with your books? Right. Yeah. Well, can we, so, can we go like this way? And actually, we'll, we'll do the person who reads it. Reads read it, it, start. Yeah, who reads it, starts. And, and we'll go, go this way. Left. Okay. The high schoolers do not have lockers where we get a high school, so we just carry all the books on our backpack. Katie, though, has some extra storage because she's on the cheer team. Right? Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Oh. Stop. No, fun, he's bro. right. So I bring two yeah, backpacks into me. school every day. And one of them has all my school stuff in it, and one of them has all my cheer stuff in it for practice and everything, and like some extra food. So we have these team rooms, which are just like locker rooms, and I go there every morning before I go to my classes, and I drop off one of my backpacks, and then we carry our backpack, <coughs> <coughs> sorry, oh with like our books in it for the rest of the day, like the school day, we just bring our backpacks with us. How about you, boy? So we do have lockers, uh, and they assign you at the beginning of the year. They say put a lock on it if you want. Nobody uses the lock. Actually, that's a lie. Some people do. I use mine. If I you're mine if you're relevant though, you don't use a locker. Oh, cause so, you're so cool. Because yeah. you're so cool, you carry your little binder with a handle on it that and goes down to your ankles. <laughs> he literally um, holds his binder and it goes down to his ankles. Okay. I just want to say, I I do not use my locker, and actually yesterday we had, they told us we had to put all our stuff in a locker, and I just went to like my section, and I forgot my locker number, so I just threw it in a random locker. So, uh, yeah, I don't use a locker, I just have a string bag, and I don't really need to bring any books, it's just a binder. Books stay at home. Ew. <laughs> Ew. What? All my okay, books are in my room. So. Okay, next question. Oh wait, that was from the bottom. We're supposed to go from the top, right? Because she's throw it kind of in order. Yes. Yeah. Okay, cool. So, if you could drop a class, which would it be and why? This is the easiest question anyone will ever ask me in my entire life. AP Gov, I would drop so fast. What? I hate that class How? so much. It just makes me so mad. I just can't see about the public and about the government. Guys, I'm so sorry to interrupt the video. I just want to tell you, if you like the video, subscribe to watch more like this, and hit the notification bell, and you'll be the first to see them. All right, get back to the video. Right. But I um, hate it. My There's so much work. There's like three hours of homework, and then like, I just, So our schedule just totally changed this year. So the thing is, I, I'm doing 
one class, or so, uh, A days, B days, so A days, or B days I have Jim, and A days right now I have Avid, but it'll switch over, so I'll have Avid first, second, like, quarter, and then third and fourth I'll have another class, and I'm doing, uh, digital palette, which is like, are you Photoshop. gonna answer the question at the end of yeah, the Yeah, so like, you can just say, character. I mean, I'm just to save time, I'm not trying to mean, <laughs> but to save time. I'm this, literally just explaining no, no, Anyway, no, just so like, I, it's literally there's fine. also, it's I, like, it's a one word answer. Like, what class would you drop? Art? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you know what? For okay. team sports, because it's really fun. And I'm not doing that. it. Wait, so what class are you dropping? Hey, hey, it's my turn. to answer the question. to go. Oh, right. I would drop. Uh, honors physics and make it either uh, standard physics <laughs> or some other physics because that's a very hard class and I already have my fair amount of AP physics. Uh, yeah. Mara? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, AP Chem. AP Chem. Not, not AP physics. So, which class is my hardest? Or, oh yeah, so. <laughs> so it's basically the same for me and Katie. Yeah, well, which class is your hardest? Class? Which are hardest class? Uh, um, mine would be. I love U.S. history. It's not a hard class. We just get a lot of work. But I say the hardest class. <coughs> <coughs> Actually, we don't really have hard classes. Actually, probably math. I mean, not, what we're learning right now isn't that hard. But just algebra, like we got introduced into it, and it's it's not fun. I'm just gonna say. Ryan, I love you so much, and I promise I'm not being mean. But algebra but, one's the easiest thing ever. No, if we could just shorten our answers just a little bit, it would give us more time for all of us to answer and then to move on to the next question. But nobody cares about your answers. Uh, oh, that was, uh, that was mean. That was mean. That was mean. Hardest class, it's either honors physics or AP Lang because the thing about Lang is you what? write something and I heard you it hate, I heard people hate AP Lang. It's like about what teacher you have and how they grade you. Um, so like I don't know. I thought I wrote a beautiful time right, sixteen out of twenty. I don't know what I could have done better. <laughs> I feel like I should have gotten an A on it. My grade in that class is an eighty-seven. My grade in physics is an eighty-eight. So and you're saying yeah, you're so, saying I have long answers. Okay. Now you're saying yeah. so. Mm, so mine is kind of the same as his. So Gov is my least favorite class, but the hardest one is English because I have a really really hard teacher. She's like the teacher that everyone's like, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry that you have. The like, hardest. she's the hardest. And like, it stresses me out so much. Cause like, you do something, you're like, wow, this is great work. And then it's like, <laughs> oh, you almost got it's, like, <laughs> it's like, how did I get that? How did I, how did I do that bad? I thought it was um, good. So. I like your science teacher, Katie. You know the science teacher that's in my TikTok? Oh, Dr. Yeah. Landsman, yeah. yeah. She's dope, I love her a lot. She's a really good teacher. All anyway, right, Brennan? Which class is your easiest? Art. <laughs> gym. Are we talking easiest education-wise or easiest just in general? Easiest in general. Easiest education-wise, strength and conditioning, because you kind of just have to wear clothes and go to the class and then you get credit. The easiest. Yeah, that's uh, true. But you also lift weights, which is kind of hard. In gym, and you then, just have to try your hardest. Um, which is not easy if you try your hardest. It's not that bad. Easiest just in general is probably guitar. <laughs> Actually, Guitar's easy? Yeah, because these grades really easy. Oh. There's yeah, how do you get graded in guitar? Do you like... Uh, you go up and play for him. Oh, nice. Do you and sing like, for him too? No, there's no singing. That's funny. Um, my Can easiest class, I literally have had to apply zero of my brain cells to art. Like, mm. I like art. It's so much fun. But there was one time when I forgot, because I have art first period, English second period, I forgot a whole English assignment that was due that day because I did one part of it, but I didn't know you were supposed to write an essay with it. So in art, I literally wrote my whole essay and did all my art. And so like- That's lit. I love like, classes where you can just yeah, do other kind of, And I was like, That's my teacher came over and she was like, what are we doing? And I was like, I'm so sorry. Like, I forgot that I had this. And like, I'm almost done with this project. And she was like, okay, I'm just gonna look away. And I was like, okay. So, oh, also, there's one teacher, nice teacher that I didn't have this year, but it's literally the easiest grade. He does. <coughs> you know what I'm talking about, right? Mr. No. I don't think any of us had him. Oh, what? Mr. Take Ed? Yes, take Ed. Okay, Wait. anyway. 
tech ed. Yeah, I'm just gonna say this one. You take tech school, ed in that's middle school. So easy. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And he literally doesn't pay attention. In eighth grade. But he's I didn't a take great teacher. Shout out, Mr. P. My question is: Compare this school year to last school year. Um, mm. this school year, I actually know what I was like getting myself into because freshman year, I got, I like, went into school into high school not knowing like what to expect but this year I like knew what to expect and still stressful um I'm taking APs this year I didn't take any last year so it's like a lot more work but um we also have a way more structured cheer schedule so I stay at school for like way longer than I did last year so that's like main differences more um I'd say Last year was fun. I loved seventh grade, but also eighth grade's really fun too. Uh, Cause they're like the oldest in the school, but seventh grade, I don't know. I just like my classes better. Uh, I have some dead teachers this year and some dead classes, but just seventh grade classes were so great. And the seventh grade schedule was amazing. Uh, eighth grade schedule lunch is like after like first period and then homeroom. It's, it's, it's really stupid. Anyway. <laughs> The main difference I would say is I did not play golf this year, so I don't have to split time between golf and water polo, but also junior year is the hardest year, and I'm taking a lot of AP classes. I haven't had a lot of homework so far, but I think as the year goes on, I'm just going to go... That stresses me out an because... Essay, and then I'm going to have to do a dialectical journal, and then some stuff. Yes. That really stresses me out because I feel like I'm already struggling so much this year. Yeah. And next year, it just gets worse. Yeah, that's so that makes Everyone me. Everyone was asking me at the end of the summer, like, are you excited for junior year? I was like, no. No. Not at all. But then senior year is fun. I think so. Right? Because you only have like two classes. I think so. Or four. I think so. Okay. <coughs> next question. How do you. Ryan can't read. No, no, no. What's that word? Have. <laughs> oh, have? I thought it was how. Okay, right. I can't. Sound it out. Sound it out, buddy. Have, have you. Can you actually read it? Have you gotten in trouble by a teacher at school? Obviously. Are you kidding like me? Like ever or this year? Uh, <coughs> this year. I'm gonna say this year. Yeah, so this is back to school this year. Wait, have you ever? No, no, no. Yeah, have you gotten. Mm, yeah, have it's you. this year. It's this year. Uh, uh, let me think. Oh, I forgot to answer. Not come back to me, cause I, I I might think of something, but I definitely have like ever, but like I don't I don't know about this school. Once Miss Sipe saw me on my phone when I was checking my my grade in her class. Once um, I was sitting on a chair in media, and Miss Gray told me to get down. That's it. Oh my gosh, that lady in the media center. I don't go to media center because it stresses me out, cause like a lot of people go in there. I had to go to work on a project with like my group, and that one lady would not stop screaming at people. Do you know who I'm talking about? Yeah, I know all the ladies in the media center. She like, like if you stand up like in your seat, she's like, sit down! I can't scream, that was so ugly, I'm so sorry for that. But um, Did yeah, that, sorry, <laughs> sorry. Did you say? I'm just gonna answer the question now. Um, so I got in trouble, the only time I can really think of that I got in actual trouble, not like, I haven't got like any detentions or like anything. I haven't been late to any classes. I've actually been doing a pretty good job this year. And most of my teachers like me. But um, one time in English, I was putting on mascara while someone was presenting a project. <laughs> and apparently that's like distracting to the Very class. And I was like, well, if the class wants to watch me like pamper my beautiful lashes, like that's not my problem. Oh, um, but I think I neither. thought of one. So we were in French. Because you look stupid while there was, was a presentation so going on. I mean, like, everyone was watching. No, no. I would literally just... sit on the side of, side back corner of the glass. Like, why would anyone be like... Like, I was literally just putting my search. She's like, excuse me, Mrs. Donnelly. And I was like, uh, yeah. And she was like, are we paying attention? And I was like, yes. And she was like, Mrs. Donnelly. And I was like, would you like me to stop? And she was like, yes. And I was like... Well, I did one eye already, and I kind of have to do the other one. And she was like, Mrs. Donnelly. And I was like, it will literally take me like three seconds. And she goes, put it away, Mrs. Donnelly, or I'll take it. And I was like, well, it's, it's Cameron's. <laughs> and she was like, Mrs. Donnelly. And I was like, okay. And so I finished the eye, and I gave it back to Cameron. 
Thank you. Nice. Yeah, uh, yeah. One time, I just had to get my seat moved in front. I thought that was Wait, funny. Give, give me more time, okay? I, I, I'll get in trouble for you guys. Just, I, I haven't had enough time yet. No. Check back in with me. I'll give you some stories. Thank you guys so much for watching part one of our back to school Q&A. Be sure to check out part two coming mm -hmm. soon or already out. More back Not to school. sure. Uh, more, more, more back to school Q&A coming up here. Or, or here. here. Or, or here. Or here. Or, or here. Or here. I love that's from Spotify and Park Wonder Eat in Uber Valley. Brian, that's funny. So, nice. thank you guys for watching. Awesome. Love you guys. Comment, subscribe. Uh, click the link in the description for no reason. There's no link in the description. <laughs> I'm just used to saying that. Goodbye. Peace. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.